Hey YouTubers, what's up? Today is a snow day. You can see all the pretty snow outside. And because of the snow, I get the day off work. I'm a school counselor. And so I thought I'd make some videos today and I wanted to show you some new things that just came out of the kiln. Let's look at this first piece. This is a piece that I made a while back. And I do have a video of me throwing this piece. It's made with two different clays. The bottom is a B3 brown and the top is porcelain. As you can see, when I th threw the piece, I let some of that brown clay come up on the top and then I used the trim tool and kind of carved away some of the slip to make the stripes. I told you guys that I would post this after it was fired because we were wondering if the if the porcelain would separate from the B3 brown because the porcelain might shrink at a different rate. But surprisingly it's really stuck together and it looks really good. So I'm going to cover that with a clear coat and uh, so I'll show you that when it's done. The other thing I wanted to show you guys is in one of my other videos I demonstrated staining these little pots with um, the B3 brown clay throw water that actually came from this pot. and. I wanted to show how those came out. They came out surprisingly different than what I expected. If you look at my other video, you'll see that those are stained uh, much darker and the firing process eliminated a lot of the colors from the uh, B3 brown and just left kind of some of the highlights. But I still think they came out kind of nifty. These now have a clear coat on them. This one has the buff clay and then it has porcelain slip on it and then I fired that and then I dipped it in the brown B3 and clear coated it and then refired it. And on the lid, let me show you the inside of the lid. Okay, if you see the inside of the lid, see that? That's what the pots looked like before they were fired. This doesn't have any of the glaze on it. It's just it's, it's just the bisquare and that's what it looked like before they were fired and then this is what they look like after they were fired. So as you can see a lot of that that's um, B3 brown clay just kind of disappeared in the firing process so that was kind of interesting. Alright so uh, I think I'm going to go to the studio and do some throwing maybe do some glazing today and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Adios.